So Cindy, you and your husband have really been angels to your family, taking care of your three sons who have ataxia. For people who don't know back at home, give us a description of this disease. Um, ataxia is a neurological uh, disorder that is degenerative, and our type of ataxia that the boys have is hereditary. Uh, basically, uh, we don't have it, and it's a recessive gene, so the kids grew up, played sports, uh, baseball, hockey, and about teenage years, they started losing their balance, and uh, now they're all three wheelchair bound, so it affects their fine motor skills, their balance, their speech, and their eyesight. Hey. How are you, Mike? Hey, Mitchie. <laughs> and this is my son, JT. JT, how are you? Nice to meet you. This is so nice of you. Thank you no so problems. much. You too. So cool. Oh my God. So that was pretty cool. I mean, Trout came out here. I don't think anyone was expecting it when it happened. But what was that that first feeling you got when you met him and you saw him? Um, it was just really exciting to see that he would come out and he was so generous and just signed whatever I wanted him to sign and really nice about it. What yeah. was this like for you to be able to, to be this close to Mike Trout and all the angels? Oh, I, yeah, it was pretty cool. I, honestly, I'm not the biggest sports fan in the world, but mm -hmm. I, it was awesome when he came out, like my brother said, signed pretty much everything anyone asked. And it's just awesome to see my brother super happy. The Kings fan. Now you got to do this, the same experience with the Kings. Your brother watched you get super happy. So again, how cool is it to see your brother get the same kind of experience? He was there for me, so I'm here for him. What does it mean to have these organizations like the Angels come together and really make a special day for your family? It is just awesome uh, to feel the support from the community. Uh, we do live here locally. Uh, we ha uh, host a walk uh, in September for taxi awareness. Just to feel that the community is here for the boys and to give them these special dreams that, you know, my one son was a, a, a goalie in high school and they played Little League and sports and, and now they're pretty much, you know, uh, homebound. So this is just, you know, I want to thank the Angels organization for sure and all the people that made this happen. Uh, this has just been a special day for our whole family. And Mike Trot, what a humble guy. I mean, you can't make meet a guy like that, you know, in sports it's hard to find someone like that that just has general love for the game and a love for life and a love for people. Thanks Mike, we really appreciate it.